platform. Namaskar, this is Nirja, and you are listening to Travel World Online. News highlights of the day. Sustainability in focus as Indian travel trade celebrates World Tourism Day 2023. Pradeep Shetty re-elected as president at Haravi's 73rd AGM. Demand for travel insurance for international trips on a rise, ICICI Lombard. Travel Trends Report 2023 reveals fascinating insights into travel preferences of Indians. JPEX takes place in person for the first time post-COVID. American Airlines joins Embraer's Energia Advisory Group. With Indian tourism and hospitality stakeholders celebrating World Tourism Day 2023 on 27 September, sustainability has emerged as one of the key focus areas going ahead for the sector. This year's World Tourism Day theme heralds a transformative milestone, a significant stride towards realizing the United Nations General Assembly's 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development and its associated goals. With the travel and tourism market poised to generate an estimated revenue of an astounding 854.70 billion US dollars in 2023, the potential for growth in developing nations beckons us with boundless promise. Local tour operators must embrace eco-conscious initiatives as pathways to prosperity and resounding success. These visionary entrepreneurs hold the keys to unlocking a sustainable future where technology-driven solutions propel us towards a green tourism ethos that is accessible and enjoyable for all, said Shikhar Agarwal, JMD, BLS International Services. World Tourism Day is a global observance that highlights the vital role of tourism in fostering cultural exchange, economic growth, and international cooperation. This year's theme, Tourism and Green Investments encourages dialogue on the imperative of sustainable tourism. Samir MC, Managing Director, Fortune Hotels said, Tourism is more than just travel, it serves as a bridge between cultures and a key driver of economic development. At Fortune Hotels, we recognize the profound responsibility that rests upon our industry not only as exceptional experience providers, key employers supporting multifarious livelihoods, but also as custodians of Mother Earth trying to conserve the natural and cultural treasures that make India the incredible and unique travel destination that it is. As we celebrate World Tourism Day, we must recognize that all of us, travelers, industry stakeholders, and most importantly, industry executives, have a collective responsibility towards reducing our ecological footprint and creating a green future that positively impacts our community thereby bringing in a fundamental transformation centered around sustainability. Tourism's future is bright as we all strive for a more responsible and well-grounded ecosystem, he added. Through pioneering eco-conscious practices and a dedication to preserving the natural beauty of our travel destinations, we are committed to crafting memorable experiences. We firmly believe that investing in preserving and conserving the physical environments of our destinations is crucial, as it serves as the very foundation of our existence and business. Our commitment to the idea goes beyond just words, it reflects in every action that takes place at Evolve Back. For instance, in a bid to cut down on our dependence on non-renewable resources, Evolve Back plans to expand its green energy production by incorporating more windmills and solar plants. We have also invested in medium-scale captive solar power plants at two of our resorts, namely Kabini and Ampi, and an onshore, off-site, windmill in Karnataka. Collectively, these renewable energy sources supply almost 50% of our energy needs. We have also taken up initiatives that focus on the management of critical resources through extensive and well-managed projects such as rainwater harvesting and waste management systems, amongst others, said Joes Rampuram, Director of Marketing, Evolve Back Resorts. During the 73rd Annual General Meeting, AGM, Held on 16 September 2023, 
the Hotel and Restaurant Association of Western India. Haravi re-elected Pradeep Shetty, director of Maharaja Hotels, as its president. Pradeep Shetty brings a wealth of experience in his role as the president and has been an active member of the association for over a decade. His long-standing commitment to the industry is further underscored by his role as Vice President of the Federation of Hotel and Restaurant Associations of India, FRI. In the new term, Nirav Gandhi will continue in office as the Sister Vice President, Chetan Mehta Vice President, Jimmy Shaho Secretary and Parmajit S. Dhayo Treasurer of Haravi. Gurbir Bedi takes charge as the JT Ho Secretary in the new term. Over the last year, under Shetty's leadership, Haravi spearheaded several campaigns covering various facets of the hospitality industry including food safety, regulatory advocacy, talent retention and development, and sustainability. In our ongoing commitment towards environmental sustainability, Haravi is proud to join hands with the government's Mission Life Initiative. Our pledge to save the environment underscores our dedication to adopting environmentally conscious practices within the hospitality industry. Our recent collaboration with IGBC is a significant step in this direction, reinforcing our commitment to reducing our environmental footprint and promoting sustainable practices. Together, we aim to create a greener and more eco-friendly future for our industry and our planet, said Shetty. Haravi's activities over the past year included engaging with the government during the union budget, collaborating with the Ministry of Tourism, simplifying GST compliance, addressing cyberbullying, taking legal actions, addressing talent shortage, and taking up the matter of license simplification via recommendations on ease of doing business AODB. We have been advocating the need to streamline and simplify licensing procedures to enhance the AODB in the industry and move them online to reduce administrative burdens on applicants. For the prosperity and growth of the industry, it needs a business-friendly environment with reduced administrative complexities. We will continue to engage with the policymakers and the government to bring around the much-needed changes towards the AODB initiative, concluded Shetty. ICICI Lombard General Insurance, one of India's leading general insurers on World Tourism Day on 27 September, has published the findings of its recent consumer study on international travel behaviors of Indians and has found that 76% purchase travel insurance for their most recent trip and they intend to purchase the same for the next trip reached a whopping 92%. The findings further explain that a remarkable 73% of respondents demonstrated a high level of awareness regarding the importance of travel insurance, underscoring the growing consciousness of safeguarding travel experiences. Furthermore, the study uncovered that awareness of travel insurance increases with the progress of the family stage, as married couples with kids emerged as the highest travel insurance purchasing class at 78%, followed by married couples with no kids 67%, and singles 66%. The study delved deeper into the psyche of the Indian traveller and shed light on their preferences, awareness and habits, unique to each type of customer class, family, couples and singles. Through the study, the insurer shed light on the current challenges with planning and executing travel plans internationally, any gaps or needs that are currently unfulfilled that can be potentially looked into and how these changes will affect the travel insurance landscape of India. Sheena Kapoor, Head Marketing, Corporate Communications, and CSR, ICICI Lombard, said, These statistics underline a growing consciousness among travelers to safeguard their travel experiences and protect themselves against unforeseen events. It is indeed encouraging to see that travel insurance is no longer an afterthought but a proactive choice for a majority of respondents. Additionally, the correlation between family stages and travel insurance awareness is a noteworthy discovery, 
demonstrating that individuals are increasingly recognizing the importance of securing their travel plans, particularly as they progress through various life stages. At ICICI Lombard, we are committed to providing comprehensive and tailored travel insurance solutions that cater to the diverse needs of our customers. We believe these findings will serve as valuable insights to help us further enhance our offerings and continue to be a trusted partner for travelers, ensuring peace of mind during their journeys. With an exponential rise in international travel, there is a corresponding rise in the need for travel insurance. Recognizing this trend, ICICI Lombards has been promoting travel in collaboration with Radio 1 featuring the enigmatic Bollywood superstar Ranveer Singh as the host in the Hush One Travel Show Get Some Sun, Season 7, on radio. According to the survey results, a significant 70% of the respondents liked the show while overall 62% find the concept to be excellent. The show has further helped to drive preference for ICICI Lombard as 97% of the respondents claim to prefer ICICI Lombard as their travel insurance provider for their next international trip. The survey also confirms that ICICI Lombard is one of the top three purchased brands in travel insurance. ICICI Lombard's travel insurance assures quality health care with a medical cover of up to 5 lakh USD. The various offerings of ICICI Lombard cover travelers from 3 months to 85 years without any medical checkup for policy issuance. The policy covers your safety and provides value-added services for your family back home. Over the years, tourism has emerged as a formidable contributor, generating substantial revenue and employment opportunities, bolstering various sectors including hospitality, transportation, and local businesses, creating a ripple effect that benefits the entire economy. The Travel Trends Report 2023 reveals fascinating insights into the travel preferences and habits of the Indians, uncovering the motivating factors that drive their wanderlust. The survey was conducted on the online panel Hasa Chita. As per the survey conducted, it was found that most Indians, 71% prefer planning their holiday trips independently. This suggests that Indians are increasingly becoming well-informed and self-reliant travelers, armed with the tools and knowledge to curate their own dream vacations. 44% choose online travel agencies OTAs, such as Make My Trip MMT, for bookings while 20% opt for the expertise of travel agents to plan their holidays. When it comes to the timing of their getaways, India's holiday calendar displays distinct patterns. The winter months of December to February are most preferred, with a substantial 55% of travelers choosing this period to embark on their journeys. Spring or early summer from March to May attract 34% of travelers, followed by the autumn charm of September to November, drawing in 28%. Interestingly, 20% of travelers chose the monsoon season from June to August to satiate their wanderlust. Diverse preferences extend to the duration of holiday trips as well. 39% of Indian travelers opt for short getaways lasting 3 to 5 days, while 31% indulge in week-long vacations. 21% prefer weekend trips, while 9% embark on vacations spanning to 2-3 weeks, allowing for a deeper immersion into their chosen destinations. When it comes to choosing holiday destination topography, the allure of picturesque hill stations and majestic peaks captivates the hearts of 40% of the respondents. 27% yearn for a beachside retreat, 22% prefer cityscapes, and the serenity of the countryside appeals to 12% of respondents. The primary driving force behind taking a holiday for Indians is the desire to spend quality time with loved ones with 63% of respondents cited this as their primary reason for taking holidays. The opportunity to break free from the demands of work is also a compelling factor, as 57% seek respite from their professional commitments through travel. 
The survey also revealed India's overwhelming preference for domestic travel. A remarkable 81% of travelers opt to explore their own country's diverse landscapes and culture over international destinations. This inclination towards domestic travel can be attributed to two key factors, economical, 63%, and convenience, 49%. Traveling within India often proves to be a cost-effective option for families and solo travelers alike. Additionally, the convenience of shorter flight durations, zero visa hassles, and a familiarity with the culture and language makes domestic travel an attractive proposition. Among the places in India, Kerala, Kashmir, Goa, Shimla and Manali are the most favored destinations to visit. When Indians choose international travel, they prefer traveling to attractive destinations, 66%, and many cater to their family preferences, 56%. Among the favored international regions, Europe, 50%, stands out as the top choice for Indian travelers, while Asia, 23%, with its rich tapestry of cultures and landscapes, is the second choice. Among international destinations, the USA, France, Australia, Switzerland, and Italy are the most desired destinations to travel. The impact of these travel preferences on India's economy is undeniable. Globally, the travel and tourism sector contributed 7.6% to global GDP in 2022, while in India, it accounts for 5% of the country's GDP and is expected to grow at an average of 7.8% annually. The Jamaica Product Exchange JPEX, Hospitality and Trade Show took place from September 11 to 13, 2023, at Montego Bay Convention Center. The Jamaica Hotel and Tourist Association's premier trade event, JPEX is the single most important business generator for Jamaica's tourism industry. This is the first in-person hosting of the event since 2019, when COVID-19 crippled public gatherings. In three days of pre-scheduled appointments, wholesalers, tour operators, and travel agents held meetings with the Jamaica's leading tourism suppliers to conduct business negotiations. The trade show brought together more than 230 delegates, including 130 to buyer delegates, global media companies, and 100 into supplier delegates, representing from 20 countries including Argentina, Brazil, Canada, Chile, Colombia, Czech Republic, Dominican Republic, France, India, Italy, Jamaica, Paraguay, Peru, Poland, Mexico, Spain, United Arab Emirates, United Kingdom, United States and Uruguay. The first day of the event saw informative seminars on topical issues relating to destination opportunities, the health and wellness market, engaging the Jamaican diaspora, artificial intelligence, AI, and strategic marketing in the digital age. Jamaica Tourist Board, India office hosted six travel agents from the Indian Travel Trade Fraternity and an Indian media house in Jamaica for attending the highly anticipated tourism exposition. The Indian professionals conducted exclusive interactions with the leading DMCs, suppliers and brand of the Jamaican tourism product. The meetings provided India-based travel and hospitality professionals a fabulous platform to build good relations with the Jamaican delegates and tourism product suppliers. The Jamaica Tourist Board JTB, has also executed hosted new buyers program at JPEX 2023 saying, this is an exciting new innovation that will secure participation from several key airlines and wholesale partners to create inbound travel traffic and form partnership opportunities from Eastern Europe, India, Latin America, and the Middle East. The Ministry of Tourism of Jamaica has also introduced an immigration form. Beginning 1st September 2023, Travelers coming to Jamaica will be mandated to fill out the immigration form online. The Immigration Customs C5, form is an entry requirement for persons traveling to the island, whether they are residents in Jamaica or visiting. Embraer announced on Tuesday, 26 September, 
that American Airlines has signed and more with Embraer to join its Energia Advisory Group, an experienced and knowledgeable team of airlines, lessons, suppliers, and other aviation experts advising Embraer on its development of sustainable aircraft for the future. The more with Embraer will see the companies working together to define and establish the real-world requirements for sustainable, emission-free, and commercially viable aviation. American is a recognized leader in the drive for sustainable flight and was named 2023 Eco Airline of the Year by Air Transport World. American operates the youngest mainline fleet and the largest regional fleet among U.S. network carriers and in 2022 consumed more than 2 million gallons of sustainable aviation fuel. It has also invested in the development of hydrogen-powered propulsion and infrastructure. American will work with the advisory group and Embraer to help define performance and design requirements for its four Energia concept aircraft. These aircraft, ranging from 9 to 50 seats, will use a range of electric, hydrogen and hybrid propulsion technologies. We are delighted to work with Embraer to help develop Energia concept aircraft, said Jill Blickstein, Vice President of Sustainability at American. As the operator of the largest U.S. regional fleet, we believe industry collaborations aimed at advancing decarbonization technologies are critical to helping aviation reach its goal of net zero emissions by 2050. We look forward to working with Embraer and the other members of the Energia Advisory Group to develop next generation, zero emission aircraft. It's essential for Energia's success that we involve a wide variety of air operators. American joining our advisory group, with their huge presence and expertise, is a significant step for the Energia project, said Arjun Mazur, President and CEO Embraer Commercial Aviation. This group has developed into a core part of the program because of the breadth and depth of the expertise the different members bring to the table. We're excited to work together with a world-leading airline on the biggest challenge our industry faces. That's all in Bulletin. For the latest updates, keep listening to Travel World Online Radio with you always. Kabhi bhi 